Hey there guys, in this tutorial we'll be talking about Amazon RDS default ports. You need to know that running your database instances on default ports will represent a potential security concern. Moving RDS instances ports, the ports on which the database accepts connections, to non-default ports will add an extra layer of security that you need for protecting your publicly accessible AWS RDS databases from any brute force and dictionary attacks. So guys, you need to keep in mind the following audits for the endpoint default ports for each AWS RDS database engine. So keep in mind that for Aurora, for MySQL, and for the MariaDB, the default port number is 3306. For PostgreSQL, the default number is 5432. For Oracle, 1521. For SQL Server, 1433. So to, deter to determine if your existing RDS database instances are using their default ports, you need to go over the following process that I will show you right now. So go to your AWS console, log into the AWS management console and navigate to the RDS dashboard right over here. From here, guys, from the left navigation panel under RDS dashboard, you should click on instances. So you go to the dashboard and you click on DB instances. So as we can see, we've got one instance in our table. In order to uh, check the instance, you click on the RDS instance that you wish to determine. You click on it, and this will take us to the settings page. So you go ahead and click on connectivity and security. From here, you're going to have to review the available connection network section and security and endpoint and port. And there it is, guys, for endpoint and port, we've got the port number as 3306. And this engine runs on MySQL community. So MySQL is still running on the default port number that has been selected with this engine. This means, guys, that this instance is not very well, uh, is not being protected well enough, and it's uh, possible to get attacks, and uh, it's very vulnerable to brute force and dictionary attacks. You need to change it as soon as possible. <laughs> Thank you.